Can you spot the mistake in these diagrams of cellular respiration? I'm gonna show you a diagram of each of the four steps of cellular respiration. You have to figure out where the mistake is. All right, here's our first one, glycolysis. There is a major mistake within this diagram. Can you spot it? If you need some help, I'll give you a hint. Remember, there are two major steps within glycolysis. The error here is in the first part. This is called the energy investment step. We don't produce ATP in this step. We actually use it up. I switched around these two different labels here. It should be ATP being used. Here's our second step of cellular respiration, the prep step. There's something going on here that's not correct. Can you spot the mistake? In the prep step, NADH is produced, not consumed. So that's the error. All right, here's the Krebs cycle. Can you spot the mistake? If you need some help, I'll give you a hint. Remember to count the carbons. We always focus on the carbons in these steps. Oxal acetate isn't a six carbon molecule, it's a four carbon molecule, while citrate is the six carbon molecule. It's not a four carbon. Oxal acetate will bind with acetyl-CoA to produce the citrate molecule. And here's our last one. What's the mistake in the electron transport chain? I always like to link this with the electron transport chain of photosynthesis because there's something that's going on here that's the reverse and it's not the correct way here. The final electron acceptor in the electron transport chain in cellular respiration is oxygen and it produces water. However, I switched around these two molecules. You can see it looks like the water molecule is taking on the electrons and that is incorrect.